Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Blind Play Amnesia, a machine for pigs. I'm Ultima Mantoid. I have no idea where I am anymore. What the fuck? October 25th, 1899. No one misses the poor. Round up some orphans and the world will thank you for it. Disappear a whore and a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar and a lady walks safely again. I hate them. I hate them more than any of the others. This privilege, this pretend, this pretension. These so-called leaders, these pillars of society, these rich and fanciful. They wear their filth on the inside, but they are no less dirty. I have plans for them all. We will f we will feed them and then we will feed from them. All right. So I guess I need to go out this door. No. No, I guess I got to go back out the same way I came in. October 24th, 1899. We have set aside an entire wing of the mansion for their parties. We invite them from near and far, and we guzzle them in, the, in with fine wine and the finest cuts in all of London. My God, Mandus, these chops are rather divine. Who is your butcher? Feed them up, for the wine and the grains will also lend a character to the product. 
keep the flesh relaxed. Opium in the champagne and gravy. A hog roast every night for the Duke and the Duchess. An actress battered and sliced. An artisan in every mouthful. An importer of fine tea stewed in his own leaves. They bicker and breed under the table by the fireplace. On the carpet stained with wine and fat. Whilst long dead nobles of deformed grace and cold stare watch. Cold stare watch them from gilded frames along the crooked walls. We will hose it down later as we shovel them into our machine. Children, remember, silence and hard work are the roads to heaven. Gosh. Okay, so uh, the machine is causing London to explode. There's a paper here. 23rd of December, 1899. I stand and look at myself in the mirror. Penis in hand, and my reflection grins at me, and his mouth is full of the sulfur mustards. Vain fool, he sneers. Are you really so very different? Do you genuinely believe your works of evil are any greater than the rest of them? You are simply a weak man, a product, product of his age, the same as any other. This is empire, Cretan. This is the killing idiocy, the natural result of this social Darwinism. If you are evil, then this world is evil. You just let the blood run in the street rather than hiding it in the poorhouse. You hold the blade and slide it home yourself. You do not pay a man to do this for you where you cannot see it. If you are evil, at least yours is an honest evil, and that alone makes you ubermensch. And thus, I wash my hands and take to bed. Okay, so there was more to this game than I admit that I thought there was. I'm going to regret this, but I'm going to try opening this door. Okay. Alright. So I'm just going to run up this way.
Dorset Street. Oh my god. This whole game. Oh my fuck. I am so fucking dead. known I could have gotten away, I would have just run down this way. <laughs> oh my god, what? What? Streets and alleys. There are too many of these damnations, these beasts loose on the street to all have come from the engine rooms. As I emerged, I counted three of the damnable pneum pneumatic lifts, which suggests the machine has been planning this for some time. Smuggling r uh, routes to the surface all about this neighborhood. If my bearings are correct, beyond the alley, I should stand directly over the ignition rooms, and I will wager that if I find a pneumatic there, it will carry me back to the machine's heart. Beast? Creature? Where are my children? Where are my children? I need to find a lift. the world. I saw the detritus of this so-called progress. I saw starvation and disease. I saw rubbish floating in the harbor. We are ruiners, all of us. We make the world unclean.
as soon as it loads, I need to run the trash down. Not like, I'm not running the trash down in the middle of the episode. I mean like, as soon as I end this episode, I need to run the trash down. I mean, this game is getting really intense. Sorry that my commentary is lackluster, but damn. Oh, so much shit is happening. Come on, you can finish loading. You can do it, game. You can do it. I believe in you. You can do it. You can do it, game. There he goes, finally. It's been a long trip. That's what we'll say. It was a long trip. That's a long loading screen. The game didn't want to bore me, so it's like, well, we'll speed this up, but we're still gonna make it kind of seamless for you. Moving a long way. Counterattack. I have returned an angel of vengeance, a saboteur once more. I will find a way to stop this vast enterprise of slaughter. Enough destruction opened the heart before, confused the machine enough to spring its locks and secret doorways. I must cause it great shock, stab its eyes, poke hot wires into its ears, hammer to its teeth and push glass into every orifice. Then it will gasp, and in that gasp I will scuttle into its throat and stab its heart from inside. October 25th, 1899. No machine blades for Fatty Bishop and Gluttony and Gluttony Harris. Prime cuts all for the sorting bins. The very best, and always back in the dumb waiter to the kitchen above. To be stewed and plumped in gravy and bread crumb and return to the table for the next night's feast. And not every night, you see. Although, we have begun to increase the frequency of the final act. Unlike the poor, the rich will be missed, given time. But we will continue to spoil and ready them, and our fine foods are now exported to mansions and lodges across London. And it has been noted in the, in the times of late, how rather overweight the great and the good are becoming, with their diets of fine wine and rich meat. Indeed, in Punch just last week, a cartoon showed this, uh, Viscount Silva, yeah, Viscount Silva, as a stuffed pig laid upon a platter for his appears to dine upon, vicious and cowardly slander, no doubt. But he tasted delicious. This whole game is about cannibalism. Are you fucking with me? Like, I mean, it's been obvious for a while now, but I finally had to say those words. Freed from the prison of the flesh, 
free to ascend as smoke to the stars. And the good? The word? How will we save them? Show me these worthy Mandus. Show me these good. I do not see them. So, pretty much, what I'm gathering is that this machine was built to harvest bodies of people that were not worthy. But first, it was going to start with the people that wouldn't be missed. Such as the poor, the orphan, etc. Right? So, it then... It's pig line central operations. So then... Once they eradicate the world of those who will be missed, or at least they start to cull down the population of those who will be missed, let's see, the trippery. Then they feed them to the rich, fatten them up, and then they eat the rich. Wow. Coolant tanks. Yeah, this game is fucking with me. October 27, 1899. Then upstairs, to bed, to bed, to toss and turn on bloated stomachs, to copulate and puke upon Cha... I have no idea how to pronounce that. Shea, Shea Long? I have no idea. I really don't. Four poster or dressing table. Collapse at last into the engulfing mattress, drunk and drugged and fat and stupid and senseless. And spring the trap, man piggies, spring the trap. At a pull of the lever, a set of hydraulic pistons and gears are fired, resulting in three walls of steel bars dropping from the ceiling via the canopy to cage the product into the bed, preventing escape. Like at the beginning of the game? The entire bed is then tilted backwards into the wall by a powerful spring mechanism, also fed by the hydraulics. Pressure for this system is created as a byproduct of the vacuum evisceration system employed for mass production elsewhere on the pig line. In this way, we have created our very own bottle revolution. For the movement of the masses is a causal factor in the extermination of the rich. to drop the compound X into that. I sense an opportunity, my first strike. Competing these cogs with a large enough object should jam the flow of coolant, causing a pressure buildup that will split the pipes and rupture the tanks. It's what I thought. what I thought. That's done.
up this way. The spark plug. Okay, more compound X. Supposed to shove one of these on top of here or something? Oh man, I don't want to go down there. I know what's going to happen as soon as I drop down there. He's going to chase me. I wonder. second. episode is going to have to end here very soon. Okay, killed the piggy. I'm going to just jump, uh, I guess drop down here. Oh, fuck. I could have probably jumped on the body now that I think about it. Big line central operations. Okay, now. I know you, machine. I know what you fear. I will rain excrement into your very soul. I will destroy you. You are too late, Mandus. My great works are almost begun. Alright, on that note, I'm going to end the episode here. So, this is game is getting really fucked. I'm Ultimate Mantoid, and um, this is Let's Blind Play Amnesia Machine for Pigs. So next time, take care and have fun.